Hey guys, it's Danny the Medic. Welcome to the channel. Now today we're going to the best hot pot in Brooklyn. Now why is it the best hot pot? Because of the Google. It says 4.7 stars with over 2,400 reviews. Now that's a lot of reviews, guys. It's the highest rating I've seen. I mean, I looked all over, guys. The best hot pot in Brooklyn. Now, that being said, before you go there, right, you got to understand what it actually means to have such a high rating for this type of hot pot place, all right? Now, hot pot, who eats that stuff, right? Some like people who like hot pot. So the rating means that out of the people who enjoy hot pot and they go there, because if you don't enjoy hot pot, you're not going to hot pot, you know? So you go to the hot pot, you enjoy it, you know, and then you put a high rating. So that means that, you know, it is very hot potish, right? Now, if you see it this way, right? A lot of people in the comments below have been saying, hey, Danny the Medic, I know how to find a good Chinese restaurant. Oh, how so? Make sure there's Chinese people eating in there. I disagree. To me, a good Chinese place is Panda Express. That's right, guys, Panda Express. You know, good quality food that I enjoy, right? Now, this hot pot place is packed full of Chinese people, right? I know I've been there before, right? And these Chinese people are the real Chinese people, all right? You go in there, you hear it, you hear it all over. You hear them talking the native language from the motherland, right? And those people, those people, guys, give a 4.7 stars. Guys, this is going to be food that if you're not used to it, you're dead. You're dead. Guys, I'm telling you. I'm going to prove that point today by ordering their most popular soup for the hot pot, the spicy soup. And when they say, how do I want it? Do I want it medium, mild, or spicy? I'm just going to say regular. You know, just give me the usual. That's what I'm going to say. And then we'll see, you know, how dead I'm going to be, guys. All right, let's go. All right, guys, we are seated. Now, I have ordered the spicy soup, and I asked him for regular, right? Just ordinary. Here we go. Gonna prepare my eulogy. So over here at Shang, they have all you can drink stuff, right? It's in the refrigerator, so that's really good. And of course, the sauce bar, Nice and big, well labeled. Got my usual sauce, which is the garlic, the sha cha, and some scallion with some sesame oil. Good stuff, guys. All right. All right, guys, the soup has arrived. I got the spicy. Check it out. These like rectangular bricks are the spicy stuff. There's two of them in there, along with all these extra peppers on top. My God, this is how they like it, guys. This is why the people here give it 4.7 stars. I'm regretting it already. So, eating hot pot is very simple. You take the raw stuff, you put it into the hot soup, and then you eat it and hope you don't die. All right, guys, I got the cage. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put what I want into the cage, I put the cage into the little pot of death, and then when it's cooked, I take it out, bam. We're gonna give it a try. All right, gotta start putting stuff in here. All right, I'll use this. Uh, use this for now. Got quail egg, a piece of dumpling, 
I'm gonna go with oh some of this stuff thank you Iris whatever this is some of these mushroom items Uh, take a piece of this, thank you, Iris. And I'm gonna put some meat in it. All right, the soup is boiling all nice. We're gonna put this in. All right, so while we're waiting for the food to cook, I'll tell you. I went to the bathroom a little while ago, right? And I noticed that on top of the urinal, there's a little sign. On that sign is Chinese words, and I swear I do not read Chinese. The only word I recognize out of that paragraph is the first word on the top left, and it means small. Small, guys. I don't know what they're trying to say. It's right there, you look up, and it says small. Guys, that's just not right. If you guys know what it says, put it in the comments below. Thank you. Small. I wonder what small could mean. Oh. Now, some things take longer to cook than others, so I'm gonna take out the stuff that's already been cooked. Uh, the beef is ready. And I guess this thing over here, this uh, floppy stuff is ready right over here. And a little piece of meat. All right. Let's try the beef, guys. It's not so bad. Not too spicy? Not too spicy at all. Actually, the spiciness comes a good 10 seconds after... Uh... Oh, guys, guys. Oh, God. Oh, my God, guys. Oh. It's not bad at all. It's not so bad. All right, the other piece of other piece of beef right over here. Here we go. All right, guys. The rest of the stuff it should be cooked by now. Let's give that a try. Okay, so I got uh, more of the little mushrooms. It was pretty good. I believe these are seafood mushrooms. Mm. Mm. Uh, bean curd skin. Here is some kind of dumpling. Mmm. Nice dumpling flavor. All right, the spiciness is now spreading. I can feel it on the outside of my mouth. It's like burning my, my lips.
quail egg. So you may be wondering, well, how's the food? Well, I'll tell you, everything here is good and fresh, and uh, I believe it's of good quality, but as far as the flavor, the flavor of the food itself takes a back seat to the flavor of the broth. That broth got so much flavor that everything you put into it tastes like the broth. Very spicy. Spicy guys. Spicy. It is time to refill the basket. I put in some of this beef. Here's a beef ball. Uh, what looks like a fish ball. Here's some udon noodles. All right, guys. Let's see what happens now. All right. The basket of stuff should be good. Let's give it a try. It's a big chunk of beef. <sighs> be careful guys, it may be hot. Let's try some of these noodles. Woo! The noodles really took on the spicy flavor. It's really good. Noodles, guys. Noodles. The beef ball. Beef ball is nice. The spiciness didn't penetrate too deeply into it. Fish ball. Also nice. Now that uh, hunger, hunger beef. Pretty darn good. So overall. If you don't mind spicy, this is an excellent place. I say everything here tastes really good. I'll give it a, a 8.5 for everything, right? I can easily say that because, like I said earlier, the foods are fresh. Everything ends up tasting like this, like the broth. So next time I come, I'll be like, no spicy. All right, guys, I'm going to call this the end of the video. Everything here is very good. I give everything an 8.5, fresh, delicious. Everything tastes like the broth. All right, have a good one. Help me.